Hey, what's up guys? MGH here. Welcome back to another episode of the Portsmouth Road to Glory. I apologise for not getting a video out yesterday. I had some minor surgery. Today I'm feeling great. I'm back into it and we're going to get back into hopefully some good form. We've got Fulham away from home up first. We are currently in 10th, I believe it is. Let's just double check that I haven't got that wrong. There you go. So we're three points below Spurs. So I need to keep winning and Spurs need to drop points. There's not many games to go. Only five games remaining of the season and I want to break into that. I want to try and get ninth. I think that should be my ultimate target, maybe even eighth. So let's get into the game against Fulham now. It's Dembele against his old club. He's going to start up front. Let's get into it. So I'm still playing that 4-2-3-1 formation that seems to have really changed my season. The formation just seems to work with these players that I've got. So I'm hoping today we can continue this winning form. And Fulham away from home, it's, it's a good platform to do that. I don't think they're going to be too strong. They're actually 17th in the league as you can see there so come on lads let's get a better goal difference as well with the last five games to go it's my strongest team possible but with Dembele up front I wanted to play him against his old club like I mentioned before see if he can get an assist maybe oh what a ball that is go on McNerney I can't believe I've missed that that would have been one nil within five minutes I couldn't have asked for a better start but I've missed it how we're gonna venture down this right side if we can never mind we're gonna go inside here's Dembele on the wing over here to Gomez Back to Dembele, maybe. Oh, chest that. Oh, so unfortunate. Win the header, at least. Yes, right, we've got it back. That's how you play well. Retain the ball if you lose it. Now, here's Deba. I'm going to finesse it. Yeah, OK. I've decided to put Deba in the team instead of uh, Riley at the moment because Deba's performing so well, but that's not his strength. He's not going to score many goals. Here we go on another attack. Inside to Deba, I think. Oh, look at the space out here for Chevalier. Come on, son. Up to Dembele. This is nice. Come on, Dembele. We need a goal. We need a goal. Back to Chevalier. He's gone for the shot. Rebound for Deba. Oh, my God. He scored. Deba has scored. I was just saying how he really doesn't score many goals or won't score many goals. And then he scores. That's just typical, isn't it? But I'm more than happy to score in any way. It doesn't bother me. As long as I score and we get points, that's all that matters. And Deba has stepped up with a very important goal in the first half. And again, guys, this form seems to be continuing nicely. We're playing some good stuff today. Here come Fulham, though. Need to be careful. Here's Mitroglu. He's a good striker, and he's pulled off a great save there. Fiamozzi, what a player. And there we have it. That is half-time, guys. We're playing well. Fulham look dangerous when they do get on the attack, but I'm, I'm having a lot of possession, so I'm not really conceding many attacks. Let's get into the second half and hope we can get just one more goal, maybe three goals. That'd be great. Here we are on our first attack of the second half. It's Eorfa. Inside here to Loftus Cheek. We're going to turn the defence. Hit it. It's not a bad shot. It's just gone wide there, but we're looking dangerous still. Here's Loftus Cheek. Drive that pass. Here's McNerney. I've just about won that. Here goes Gomez now. Inside to Deba. Here's Gray. And it's a massive save by Stecklenburg. How is it not 2 0? Corner comes in now. That's a good delivery. Oh, hang on. Let's come out here to McNerney. Hit it. Go on, son. Oh, it's hit the post. No freaking way. We should be winning this game comfortably now. Turn him. Oh, lovely Gray. Well played. Over the top for Chevalier. It's not the best pass ever. I've somehow got the ball still. Up to Dembele. I'm going to hit this early. Go on. Oh, my God. That would have been absolutely incredible. And I'm going to give away a foul there, aren't I? Oh, never mind. The referee's ended the game. There you go, guys. We've got the three points. It's exactly what I needed. However, I was not clinical enough in this game. I had so many chances to score, yet... It was only 1-0. So in the next game, I need to be putting away my chances more. Well, guys, it turns out that our next game is up against Manchester United, top of the league. It is just, it's the worst time impossible, really. However, we have just beaten them in the FA Cup semi-finals. To get into the final, we beat them on penalties. So technically, I didn't beat them in the 90 minutes. And that's all we've got time for, obviously, in this game. It's in the Premier League. Bale. I actually forgot about Bale. God damn it, he's so frustrating to play against. Such a good player in this game. But come on, guys, we can do this. It's going to be a really tough challenge, guys, but I think I'm up for it. I really think I can do it. Here goes Gray now. We'll get that into Maximin, who's back into the side today. Over the top. It's a bit heavy. Keep it in, please. Please keep that in. Yes, Chevalier, well played. Now get the cross in. It's not bad. McNerney's back post. He's not really going to win that header, is he? Now, Riley's back into the squad today. He's found a pass. It's deflected, but actually still found the play. Here goes Gray. Get another cross in because no one's near me. That's a good ball. Valdez. That, that is really good goalkeeping. Man United have started badly here. We're actually... We're, we're playing well again. Here goes McNerney. 
see if we can get a player through here. We can. Here goes Gray. Oh, please. If we can get a goal now. Pen. Penalty. Yes, we've got a penalty. 35 minutes in. Oh, dearie me. Rojo with a terrible challenge. I just stopped the ball to take him on. And look, at he's missed the ball completely. What a donut. We're not letting Gray take it. Surely it's got to be Maximin. Oh, my God. His penalties are bad. I never really looked at that. So, 71 is our best kick taker. It's going to be McNerney. He's my free kick taker as well. Here we go. I'm going to go bottom right corner with loads of power. And it's not too bad at all. Look at that, guys. We are 1-0 up against the league leaders. Suck on that. I think that actually we're going to go on and win this game. Genuinely, I feel confident. And I've changed my mentality when playing with Portsmouth lately. Just stay positive. I was complaining a lot. And when I was complaining a lot and being negative, I wasn't playing well. And now I'm being positive and I'm winning games. I don't know if it's a coincidence. I don't want to jinx it though. No. No. Oh, I thought that went in. Ref, blow the whistle. Man United is suddenly just on my ass hard. Look at this. They're just dominating the play. Blow the whistle, ref. Yes, we've got it. We've got it. Just hit it out. Blow your whistle, ref. Come on. Blow the whistle. Are you kidding me? This is the longest two minutes of my life. There we go. Right, we're into half time. 1-0 to the good. This, this is really good, guys. A good performance so far. A little bit shaky towards the end there, though. Oh, what a ball that is. What a ball. Come on, McNerney. Come on, son. We need a good cross here. Oh, my God. Bale has just absolutely taken me out. It's going to be a yellow, but I would give the bastard a red for that. What the hell? Reckless play. What? Not even a yellow card for that. But now we have a good opportunity to get the ball in here. And Riley's there. Go on, Riley. Oh, how has he not won the header there? He's six foot six, for God's sake. I think I'm going to change to counter-attacking football as well. So if we do win the ball in this kind of area, we can just hit them hard on the break with my pacey players, you know? Oh, lovely pass. Oh, yes. McNerney, come on, son. He's up against Robin. Pass it across. It's worked. Back over to Maximin. Yes. No. How? How have I missed that? That was the three points in the bag. Oh, my. that has to be the miss of the series. How? Oh, no, I'm, gonna, I'm not going to win this game now, am I? EA Gods, please don't do this to me. Just under five minutes to go, guys. We're defending well. They've given away the ball here. Could be on the break. Yes, we are. Holy shit, this is it now. Gray, you've got to score this. You have to score this. He's only gone and scored it. We have beaten the top of the league team at home. 2-0 by the looks of things. Oh my god. They can't beat us at the moment. The FA Cup final was a fail. They should have beaten us that day. And now they're playing us in the league, away from home. And they can't beat us here either. <laughs> what a shame. Good finish, lad. Come on. They do have a corner in the last few minutes. The keeper's come up, but Fiamozzi. Oh, man. I'm just going to smack that out. See you later. Oh, hang on. There's no keeper, is there? No, ref. It could have been 3-0. That's actually bouncing in, isn't it? That's hilarious. But, guys, changing my tactics in the second half to counter-attacking football changed this game completely. They were all over me. I would make a tackle and, boom, hit them on the break. So... It worked a charm and we've won another game and it's against top of the league, Manchester United. What a performance. So it's time for some training guys and I've changed it up once again. We've got three drills for Chevalier and two drills for McNerley. Let's see if we can get some growth here today. No, we can't, but that's okay. It's progress. I really want McNerney's passing just to be slightly better. And obviously Chevalier, we need him to grow as soon as possible to catch up with some of the better players in the squad. But guys, some really good news. We've actually made it up to 8th and it's very possible if we continue winning games, we can get even better. Maybe even 7th, but I think Stoke are a little bit too far away from us right now. 6 points, so it's unlikely they're going to drop that many points. We would need them to lose pretty much every game for us to overtake them, so... It's looking like 8th is the best finish we're going to get, but who knows? Stoke, uh, not Stoke, Newcastle could drop some points and we might then make it into 7th, which I would be, I'd be very happy with. So guys, into the next game now and we have Norwich away from home. It's another team that have been struggling and it's another opportunity to get a win and I need another win. Here is Norwich's team. They've actually got 5 at the back, but I don't blame them. They are bottom of the league in 20th place, guys, and if I don't beat them... I'll be very, very, very embarrassed and disappointing. I said this when we played against Hull, I think it was. They were bottom at the time. 
And I said, oh, I'll be so disappointed if we don't win. And then we didn't win. So today I'm not going to let that happen. We've got my strongest team possible. Let's get into the game now and beat Norwich. No, 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 no. Oh, good save. Fear Motsi. that could have been a goal. I wouldn't have wanted to concede there. Let's get on the break now. Lovely ball. Flick it on. Yes. Here goes Gray. Nope. Okay. He's going to let it go through him. Norwich have actually made a very good start. I'm very surprised. At this point against Man United, I was playing really well, getting chances. But Norwich just... They've had the ball the whole freaking game so far. So need to change something, I think. I think maybe it's just because I've been a bit sloppy on the ball. So let's try and keep it a little bit better here. Here goes Max Min. Over here to McNerney. Passed it up here to Gomez. Ball back post. Oh, hang on. It's deflected. It's gone onto the roof of the net. Right. We've got a corner. This is a bit better now, guys. We're, we're keeping the ball. Let's get a good delivery in from Gray. Oh, that's not bad, you know. He offers there. He's won the header, but it's a good save from the keeper. Come on, one last chance. Come on, Chevalier running now. Here's Gray. Come on, one more chance. Oh, I've ran too far with it, but I'm going to keep it with Maximin here. I'm going to get that out to Chevalier. Oh, never mind. I will take a free kick there. Wait, what? <laughs> that is laughable. The referee's ended the first half. I had a free kick within 30 yards. I would have scored that. Come on. Here come Norwich in this second half and they've scored. <laughs> I can't believe this. Pretty much the first attack of the, the second half and they've scored. I can't believe it. Look at this defending. It is so, so poor. He just passes it in. Completely unmarked. Well played, guys. After these fantastic wins against Manchester United. Now we go to bottom of the league, Norwich. And we're 1-0 down. Just unbelievable. It's just so me. It's okay. I'm pretty calm. There's still 20 minutes to go. We just need to get a goal and get back in this pretty much now. Here goes Loftus-Cheek. He's been quiet today. He's lost the ball again there. Oh, God. Here come Norwich again, though. I've been caught attacking. Fiamozzi with a good catch. Right, throw it out as soon as you can. We're going to play for a draw here, pretty much. Unless I can nick a goal here and then get one more. This is a good bit of play, though. Up here to McNerney. On the left side, we're going to continue running here. He's just got so much pace. Now get the ball in. It's a good delivery. Go on, Gray. Go on. Yes! We're back in it, guys. Right, seven minutes to go. We can get another goal and we can win this game now. Come on. Play it out here to Chevalier. Little one-two inside. Continue that run. This is it, guys. Last chance of the game. We're going on the inside. No, I've lost it. Oh, I've got it back. No, Rev, you can't do that. Oh, whatever. We get a point, guys. Oh, it's so frustrating. I'm so frustrated that we haven't won this game. Oh, I'm absolutely gutted, guys. Because of that draw, we've dropped down into 10th again. So with two games to go, I think, really... I need four or six points out of six. I just, I can't afford to lose a game now if I want to finish in ninth or eighth. We could potentially move up into seventh. Spurs there with 54 points, but who knows what's going to happen. It will be in the next episode, two games in the Premier League and then the FA Cup final. So I'm really excited to get into that soon. And that will be, up, of course, up tomorrow. Thank you so much for watching this, guys. I really hope you've enjoyed the episode. If you have, please do smash a like rating on it. I would really appreciate that. Maybe we could hit 4,000 likes on this episode. That would be really cool. If you're new around here, make sure you hit subscribe as well. And also, guys, some big news regarding my shop, shop.officialmjh.com. Keep your eye out. There's some new products coming out this week, and I cannot wait to show you them. So thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.